Hey guys, we are back with Let's Play The Sims 2 Autumnus Family Part 9. Okay, so I made some changes to um, my recording software because the last few parts I recorded didn't have game sound and like I literally have no idea what happened there. Um, I had a new headset, but like I used the auxiliary to plug it in, um, but somehow that messed it up. So I went back to using the Bluetooth version um, and it's working much better now. I also fixed the aspect ratio, so there should be no more black bars along the side of the screen. And I also um, should be recording at higher quality through the recording software. So we'll see how the gameplay goes. Like if it, you know, slows my computer down, I'll, I'll let you guys know. Obviously, I mean, we'll, you'll see as well, but yeah, anyway. So we'll see how we go today. Um, I'm very, very excited. We've got so much planned for today's part. So first things first, I've decided that I'm going to age up Tommy. So Sunday will be his birthday. Just because we did have aging pause for such a long time, um, the fact that he's so close in age to the twins doesn't really sit right with me. So I think that's going to be the best option to age him up. Um, what else we got planned for today? I want to go out and buy David and Tommy some new clothes because obviously Tommy's going to become a teenager and David is now a adult. Um, I'm going to get a second elixir of life. I actually want to do that right now just before I forget because I want to possibly, we might possibly have to use it um, on either Peter, Samantha or even Dora. I don't know, but I have decided that once Dora gets to the top of her career, um, I'm going to stop using the elixir of life and let her um, pass on. Um, what else do I want to do? I also really want to try and get the um, all the kids into a private school today. So um, I'm going to be inviting the headmaster over. Um, hopefully our house is looking good enough um, and we'll suss that out. Um, and then we're really obviously just going to focus on our promotions. Um, and I'm going to try and cut the parts down to about 30 minutes each now. Because obviously the last few parts have been quite long. So I get it's kind of a lot to sit through. Um, yeah, I currently am like recording quite ahead as well. I just want you guys to be aware of that. So like, for example, at the time right now when I'm recording, I've only got part four. I've only just released past part four, uploaded part four. Um, and I'm recording part nine. So like I've kind of gone ahead a bit. I'm kind of rec like releasing them slowly. So like, obviously if you guys, you know, give me any feedback in like parts like four or five or even three, two or one, like, yeah, I'm kind of like recording ahead, which is not ideal, but I just, yeah, I'm very excited. I'm really enjoying this family. So we're just going to give that a go. Sorry for the long intro. That was literally three minutes. Oh my gosh. Anyway, we're going to get started. Um, we're just going to regroup. So Peter, he's just doing whatever he wants. Dora's having a snooze. Sam's having a snooze. Yep. They're all pretty tired. I think we just had his party from memory. Um, Peter's, sorry, David's party. I mean, I always get their names mod off. It's actually so bad. Um, do we need to work on any skills for anyone? Um, oh yeah. You're in a good mood, so like, let's just get up real quick. And I really just want to work on your skills. So, oh, I just hit the wrong button. All right, mechanical, we're going to work on first. Amazing. Why are you guys going outside? It's literally pretty cold outside. Like, it's only just clicked over to spring. Um, yeah. Really sh oh, do whatever you want, honestly. No worries. Peter, did I not just ask him to study mechanical? I think I did. Oh my god, wait, no, it was, D it was David. Oh my god. Sorry, Peter. Oh my gosh. I just literally yelled at you for no reason. Um, we are still considering having an affair with Priya. I think that might happen in a few parts' time. I'll let you guys know. Um, I've got a few things planned for this family. I'm very excited. Really just want to start. Um, a couple of storyline things going on soon. Won't reveal too much, but yeah, we'll see how we go. Oh, that he just flew through his skill. I'm already noticing the recording is a little bit like, like especially when I speed up, it's like, yeah. I can't remember what I changed, but I changed something in my OBS. Um, I have to go back and I remember it was something to do with like, Oh, I can't Lidlin. think of it from my head, but yeah, I remember recording something and it said, like, be aware, this is only for high-end machines, so maybe I'll have to change it back. Um, but let me know, like, I'll see, obviously, if it, like, improves the quality, like, we might have to just sort of suss that out. Yeah, he's ready for his promotion. Um, he can probably just go to bed because it is pretty late. Dora, doll, how you doing? Writing in your diary, no worries, I'm just going to either get up and maybe do some things. Um, is there anything that's been done around here? No, nothing really cool. It's very exciting. We're kind of just like out of that. Oh, I should have my clean up. 
Um, she's, we're kind of at, as a family, we're out of that horrible period where, you know, we had so many kids. Like, I'm really, really happy that we're out of that now. Um, do we have any leftovers? Yeah, we do. Cool. And we'll just suss out what leftovers we've got because we might cook some, a variety of foods. So we've got brekkie and uh, yeah, we might cook some lunch food today. Um, Sam, Sam's getting up for the day. She don't work at all. No, I don't think they work on weekends, the education career. Oh, all three are off except for Peter. Oh my God, David. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. Literally getting their names so muddled up. I really do want to work on the cooking skills of the kids. Uh, I think it's a really good thing for them to have. I really just don't want any of the kids setting anything on fire when they become teenagers. So I think it's just good practice, honestly. Um, and I'll just wait for Charlotte to eat something and she has to start that. Um, I don't think you can... Oh, maybe we will cook some brekkie, actually, because she's literally a super last serving. No worries. Sam's got the day off. Enjoy your day off, doll. Peter, can you cook anything? No. Um, it's kind of just going to be us waiting to get David promoted, which I'm so excited about. Oh, yeah, we're already getting some cooking skill on both fronts. Um, which is the other kid that... Oh, yeah, this... Oh... Oh no, all three of them are learning. Cool. All three of them, yay! Dora's just a gem. She's already really high with her cooking skill. Um, both the parents are really high as well. And yeah, I'm gonna also focus on David, but maybe not when he's like, you know, needing a promotion. This is first day at his technically new job as an adult. Oh, these kids are just flying through their learning. Love that. Maybe you can make the bed. Um what can we do with Peter? Honestly, we, I do want to go on a date with Priya at some point, but I don't think we're going to be doing that at like today. I don't think I want to do that today. I, maybe we could work on some of these, um, things like maybe he can learn like parenting. I think it's the one that's really good is lifelong happiness. I'm pretty sure. I think it has something to do with like here, but I mean, also fire safety or are they just kind of pointless? I don't even know. I feel like Peter can just like do whatever. I don't even care. We will give some. Don't worry, we've got plenty for Peter to do pretty soon. <laughs> Prayer. Joking. Um, so yeah, we'll see how that goes. Oh, actually, isn't there brekkie food? Yeah, there's brekkie food here. Where did the. Where did the food go? What? Didn't she just cook like a whole platter of food? There's no way. Where did it go? Did someone clean it up? Or is like it been eaten? There's no way it's been eaten. Oh my god, that's so cool. What a honestly. Not shocked. Alright, um, he's in like a really, really good mood. Um, we could maybe just get his start up a little bit more. Just to really solidify. Um, his promotion. I also do really just want to solidify their friendships because friendships decay so quickly and it's literally so stressful. Um, I'll s I want to pick the lowest. Yeah, Ginger. Okay. I want you to call up Ginger. Ginger doll. Let's have a little chat. Um, who is her lowest one? Um, this girl. Um, I literally forget her name. Her friend's name. Gabriella. Bye. Call Gabriella. Um, excuse me. Um. What? Are you bugged out or something, Dal? Do you want to like actually do what I just told you to do? Because that'd be amazing. Oh my god. What? Call someone. Oh. God, these Sims. Um, I do want to also. Oh, speaking of all of this, anger management can be very important to your Sims in your equilibrium to help your Sim. I don't really know if there's actually any benefits to this. I literally want to Google it right now. Let me get my phone out. I'm actually curious. Um, I also do want to do that and invite the head off over. Because I don't know. Sims to life. Oh, I won't do that one. I'll do fire safety benefits? Question mark. Yep. Headmaster's going to come over. Um, okay. Life skills. Life skills are introduced with the Sims free, Sims free time. 
Um, parenting can be learned in a book. Oh, Sims can check on babies. Okay. Yeah, I thought it was that. Fire prevention. The Sims with this skill will be more effective at putting out fires and calmer when fires actually start. That's handy. Reduces the chance of Sims becoming furious with another Sim. This is for anger management. That's handy. Lifelong happiness when a Sim will learn this skill. Here's her aspiration level. Will take much longer. That's so handy. The aspiration here will go down so much slower. Physiology, the Sims with the base, uh, basic physiology, build body skill faster, gain fitness faster, and lose it slower. Couples counseling, and now in now's the new interaction repair relationship with. Okay, these are actually really really handy. Okay, so I think maybe anger management could be a way to go. Um, why don't we all work on our anger management? Come on, all work on that. We gotta just not forget that the headmaster's coming over, and I want to cook him a turkey. Um. I wish all of the, oh, the doors are actually all unlocked, so we can maybe just get, the, yeah, I unlocked them all because they kept doing weird things with the books, it was like so annoying. Um, okay, you can just wait then, calm down. Alright, how are we going with all of our, oh, Charles at four, five, five, oh my god, that's so good. You can probably stop. Oh yeah, you should probably stop, wow, this one needs food. Um... What was I just doing? Oh yeah, we were getting their relationships solidified. Um, you don't have to worry. Oh, oh, I thought that was that's just David. Lol. I feel like the rest are pretty good. I feel like we don't have to worry. I'm kind of concerned about Gabby because I know that we only just ticked over. Um, maybe it's Sunday. Like, let's call your friends over. Let's call over Gabby. <laughs> David will be off to work soon. Very exciting. Um, oh, you can just have some after the breakfast. Um, I wonder if the greeting is still glitched out. Oh my god, there is a hole. I think the greeting is being... Oh no, it's working now. That was weird. The other part, like I had to press on like the the um other greetings. It was so weird. Alright, head to work. Amazing. And I really just want to become besties. Super, super mega besties with Gabby. Wow, that was slow. Did you see that freeze? Oh my god. I think I should not have changed this before. Give me a sister. Oh, I was about to say sister. Oh my god. Give your friend there a hug. Can she fill in holes? No, she can't. Has to be an adult. Oh, we're really making good progress there. Oh. Oh, okay. You don't have to do everything. You literally don't have to be super... Okay. Delete that out. Um, anyway, so I'm going to now call, I think, a Lando. Call Sim. A Lando. Alright, Elena's gonna come over. Alright, amazing. Let's keep working on our skills. The parents are going away with their um, life, sorry, anger management, which is so helpful. Alright. Charles Carpool's coming soon. Oh, quickly go talk to Elena. Carpool's coming, babe. Oh my god, I love listening to their voices. I'm so sorry we couldn't hear the voices over the last few parts. I'm so upset about that. Oh. oh. Did you guys just see that? I didn't... There's no attraction to him, I don't think. Oh my god, they just like started a relationship on their own. I literally... Did I... Okay, I'm watching the footage back. I did not press that. They literally just did that on their own. Okay, is that even helping? Oh, actually it is. Oh. Um, but his, they're like not attracted to each other, see? Like, mm, like shrug. Because I set her turn on, it's like a bit weird. I could actually change them around a bit. What does he look like? He's got, what color hair has he got? Brown hair. I can change that. Maybe we can make a brown hair. Um, give him some facial hair. See, this is, um, yeah, the Renew You Porter Chug. So basically you can change your turn-ons and turns off. So maybe that'll help her be more attracted to him. Let's go suss out our attraction to him. No, that's need to help. Okay, anyway, bye. See ya. Um, how are you doing, Tommy? Oh, it's his birthday. Oh, I forgot it's his birthday. Oh my God. I am literally the worst person ever. Anyway, throw a party. Oh, I have to set it to his birthday using a cheat. Give me one sec. 
totally forgot we were going to do that. We were also supposed to go and buy f clothes for, um, let's get, we can do that soon. Alright. Dora Dar, let's get to the party, birthday party. Um, I, oh, I'm going to ignore that because I hope he's going to get promoted. Yeah, he's going to get promoted his own, I'm pretty sure. Um, Dora Dar, let's have a nice party. Oh, we can invite Morty. Oh, I think we should so get in with Morty. I'm literally so excited. We have not invited, we have not thrown a single party that has had all the guests show up, which is really, really sad. Um, anyway, Tommy, it's your birthday. Oh, oh my god, we have the headmaster coming over. What am I doing? What? What is wrong with me? Okay, the headmaster can just come to the party. It's all good, guys. No stress. Um, we're okay. Um, Dora, you can't click Chelsea until 5 o'clock. Oh my god. It's okay. We got this. We got this. We got this. All good. Peter's gonna go scrub up for. No, we're not doing that. I hit the wrong button. Um, we're gonna go scrub up for the headmaster. Let's stop learning the anger management. Um, we got this, we got this, we're all good, we're all good guys, we're gonna have a really, really good, um, oh, Morty, early for the party, oh my god, is Morty the only person that came to the party, are you serious, oh. wait, where's the party, oh no, oh my god, wait, didn't we throw a party, what happened? Okay, it's probably. I was about to say nature's way, but like. It's their way of saying for him to not. No, he's gonna age up! Oh my god. This is a hot. Absolute hot mess. Don't go to bed. The head. Okay, just go to bed. Tommy, you can go greet the headmaster. Be like, hey, you can let me into your school. Um, yeah. Oh my god, who are you? Darren Dream is my employee. <laughs> now, let's have this not bug out again, because that was ridiculous. Okay, headmaster. Maybe you can't have the headmaster at the same time. I don't know. Our house is a mess. It's going really good. Looking really good. Yep. All good. Dora Dahl. Can't focus on Morty just yet. We're going to make a delicious turkey for our guests. Um, do you want to go maybe talk to him? Be like, hey, let me into your private school. Yeah, Alright, the party is happening. Because <laughs> 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 well, the headmaster's <laughs> at the same time. <laughs> oh, he's about to age up. Oh my god, quick, 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 go. Oh no, the birthday party is working. Go, Black Joe. No. <laughs> oh, it's okay. We'll just pretend. That was so sad. It's okay, he still got his party, no one was just watching, it's okay. Um, I'm just gonna pretend that that didn't happen, I can't even delete the cake. Um, oh, everything is happening right now. We've got to call the headmaster to dinner. Okay, just a lot going on right now. Tommy Otimus is no longer a child, what will he aspire to? Okay, I'm thinking that we should aspire for him to be knowledgeable. So it seems with the knowledge aspiration want to know everything there is to know about anything. Make sure they have the time to study and explore every nook and cranny. Their lives are simple equation. Are a simple equation, sorry. The more knowledge, the higher the aspiration meter, and the longer and brainier the life. Amazing. Okay, always just go to vampires. Um I'm just gonna go make up because that's like the easiest thing to put on a sim if you want if I want him to be attracted to someone. Um what else is good? We'll just go. Oh my god! What else should I do? I don't. We have to change it if like the Sims got like a weird hair color. Let's just go. I don't know. Let's just go. Brown is always the safest option. Oh, let's age up these Sims too. All right, Tommy, do you want to go call the headmaster for dinner? Okay, um, where's Tommy's? Okay, that was okay, but I'm glad to have grown. I feel like I'm now prepared to tackle the next portion of my life. Yeah, look, you are the forgotten child, so we'll just leave it at that. Tommy has grown into a teenager. As a child, Tommy achieved the aspiration level of gifted kid. That's pretty good. With a little hard work, life could get even better. We are definitely going to have a really good team for years, honestly. Did you call him to dinner yet? Okay, go... Enjoy your meal. Um... 
Oh, oh, someone just passed out. It's like you literally made the pass out sound. I sit down, down. We've got to give the headmaster a tour of the house as well at some point. There is so much going on right now. I don't want to start exploring their relationship just yet because there is oh, really? that much happening right now. I want to give them the focus they deserve. Tommy, do you need any food, doll? No, you don't. Maybe we'll just go to the toilet. Any kitties need food? We can go for some food. This brand of Gabrielle is choosing bins. She wants to steal our spot at the private school. Yay! Oh my gosh, Charlotte has been promoted to mime. Speaking is for those who cannot entertain in silence. With your whimsical pen to mimes and wide array of facial expressions, your silence speaks volumes. Just don't do that. Being blown away by wing thing too many times. True that. You have worked hard and now you've reached the top of the entertainment career track. Congratulations. Charlotte should be an overachiever. Yay. That is so good. Good on you. And we might get into a private school tonight. Oh, it's all happening for Charlotte. Oh my gosh. Very, very exciting. Okay. I really hope the headmaster likes the turkey. Yes, he really liked the turkey. Okay. Who do we want to give the tour of the house? Entertain, give to her. Um, this has to be perfect. Like literally nothing can be out of place. I want Tommy to go around and make sure everything is immaculate. Hey, hey, you might like this room too much. There is povo furniture and stuff. A tour of your home would be lovely. It will help me judge whether you are a family worthy of association with our institution. That is so elitist, but whatever. I love our idea. Hopefully, he likes this room because it's good cool. skill building stuff. We get over 90. We get a new today. All the kids will get a new day. What? Oh, I wasn't too impressed with the tour. You cut the tour short on your own because you're accepting all of us into private school. So that actually was not on us. That was on you. Whatever. Oh, hey. The headmaster is impressed with your family. Alison, Courtney, Tommy and Charlotte all got into private school. Yes. That is actually amazing. Let's read what it says. Got into private school. That wise headmaster must have seen your true potential. Now make sure it's worth that extra cost and get studying. Very exciting. Oh my God, I am literally so proud of us. We have gotten into private school. That is such an achievement. Okay, let me suss out where we want to head for the rest of the part. All right, I definitely do want to finish off his birthday party. All right, headmaster's going. And Mortimer, hi, Morty. How are you? Do you feel like having a romance with Morty? I feel like having a romance with Morty. What do you reckon? It's going We're obviously going to explore Mortimer in more detail in the Pleasant View Let's Play, but this is just, this is a different universe, okay? Let's pretend this is a different, like, parallel universe. Or Morty can just have a bit of elderly fun, you know? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But I hope the game audio is not too loud with all the sound effects and stuff. I'll have to suss it out. <laughs> they are so in love. <gasps> so much is happening right now. Okay, I want them to have their first kiss. Okay, before that happens, oh, Sanjay. So, Sanjay is actually Priya's husband. So, David could become friends with Priya's husband. Peter's gonna have an affair with Priya. Interesting tea. Oh my gosh. Anyway, David has been promoted to summer camp music teacher. That is true promotions. This part, we love that. A lover of campfire tunes and camaraderie, you are the leader of the campground music class. Keep your charisma and creativity high and maintain a strong level of camp memories. Love that. We brought home a little bit of extra money for the family. That is so exciting. Um, we can definitely be doing this Sunday. Never hurt to have some extra friends. We can focus on their, you know, skills a bit later. Easily get those two points. Um, oh, uh, do have to be up quite early. It's okay, we'll just get it like 30. Oh, it's kind of fun morning. Peter, it's time to get up. Your, your mum has got to have some fun. <laughs> this family is going to be like, guys, we really need to have some more double beds. 
Um, oh, this is ridiculous. Oh, 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 I really do just want to make sure he gets promoted tomorrow as well. So mechanical, let's go start working on that. Door is going to have been dead and naughty. Out you go, son. <laughs> Mama needs some loving. Okay. Ask Mortimer to join. Yeah, not bad party. It's actually getting a hell of a lot more The elders are raising the roof. Ooh, we get the awkward cut scene again. Okay, oh my god, the part, last last part, right? I rewatched it. I haven't posted it yet. But when they were woohooing, I was literally screaming over the woohoo because it was so loud in my headphones, but there was like no sound. So like it's literally just like screaming into the microphone. So I'm gonna not do that this time. I'm just gonna watch it. Mm, it's so cringy. Why are they like have little sound effects? <laughs> 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 Just look at your hip body. Granny, I'm proud of you. Finally getting back on the market. It's never too late, honestly. Alright, okay. Time to get up. You've got to go to your own bed, babe. Alright, Darren's just screaming at the TV. No worries. Um, you can actually go watch TV. Okay, I've got to just make sure everyone's in a good mood right now. Um, do you want to maybe go use the toilet? Um, Sam, you could actually probably get in your own bed. Actually, maybe you shouldn't because like, Mortimer's there. Um, Morty, maybe just shoot him out of your bed because it's really weird. Um, he's doing all good. David has gained a mechanical skill point. That's what I love to see. Um, let's gain our charisma skill next. Um, let's maybe get Charlotte ahead to bed. What's this one doing? Allison. Oh, yeah, she was going to the toilet. Is she stuck? Oh, I think she was stuck there. They're all fine here, but this chair is literally so funny. Um, we need a second bathroom. Gabriella! Um, I know that you don't have a bath or a shower on your plot of land, but that does not give you the right to use ours without asking, babe. But that's really not appropriate. Anyway, um, I'm just gonna focus. we had a good time at the party, hopefully. David has already got his charisma skill up. Okay, I'm gonna get him into bed early because he's got a big day tomorrow. So he's finished work at late, he's got an early start. And Tommy had a great birthday party. That is what I love to see. Good on you, Tommy. Okay, happy vibes. Okay, let's go get something to eat, Tommy. Um, let's all not have a party in the wash closet. Um, I don't think that is a good idea. Wow, we really need another shower. Um, you can go get something to eat, babe. Um, just go to bed because Tommy's being annoying. Um, Morty in your tight, in your love. He's got love heart jocks. That is so funny. Oh my gosh. Ali, I'm getting some food out for you, babe. Or you can go have a bubble bath if you want. Not gonna stop you there. Um, Courtney, that's actually not your bed. Courtney sleeps on the left hand bed. Nothing has changed. I don't know how many bills we've gotten about. No. All right, let's just check how we're going for time. All right, before the part's out, I really do just want to go and organize that clothing. Um, I mean, we could go now. Like, it's. Mum and dad are asleep. Technically sneak out, but I mean we're not sneaking out. Hey, let's do it. Um, don't bring anyone with you. They're just gonna slow us down. Um, yeah, we're gonna go buy some stuff. We do have some money, so that's all good. Um, is anyone else close to aging up to no. I was gonna say we could preemptively buy some extra clothes, but we won't bother with that. Okay, let me just tick off what we've done. Aged up Tommy. Bought the second elixir of life. We invited the headmaster over. We got. I've been focusing on our promotions, and we're about to buy our new clothes. And I'm going to stop the part around 30 minutes. I feel like shorter part is going to be a better option for all of us. Mm. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. Buy. Okay, we're going to buy some everyday clothes. You are not wearing that. I want to get in the red sweater. It's, um. 
David, when he was a teen, had the blue one. Um, oh, wow, that is really slow at loading. Um, yes, yeah, so we got the blue one. I want to get the red one, or like the mauvey kind of maroon colored one. Um, he got the blue. I want to get dark. The dark skinny jeans. Or do you want to borrow your brother's jeans? I kind of like the blue and the red, if I'm actually being honest. No, it's okay. We'll get something new. Um, and I want to get something for um, David now that he's aged up. Um, what do I want to get him? Do you want a full length outfit? I do really like the, just this basic H&M kind of ensemble. Um, that's more suburban dad kind of look. Um, let's get him this. Like, this is just my, like, iconic, like, easy, comfy clothes. While we're here, we can plan our outfit. Getting our new clothes. Looking hot, Tommy. All right. We'll head home and we'll get um, David to get, sh uh, sorry, plan his outfit in the morning. I'm going to go greet Daniel. He's an iconic sim. We'll definitely be exploring Daniel's story in The Sims 2. Pleasant View Let's Play coming soon. Oh, look at our cute little family. It is getting a bit crowded. Dora, she's really getting her age. She's really showing her age. I'm, I'm just kind of kicking myself for not getting her straight into the education career when this Let's Play started. But, like, I had to download a full-blown mod for that, so that's not really a me problem. That's more of a Sims um, company problem. So, yeah. I'm just going to pretend that it's not my problem. Anyway. All right. I don't think we have enough money to do anything to the house today. Um, I just kind of want to bank that. And definitely as soon as we have like a sizable amount of money, I just want to get windows. Like we literally have no windows on this side of the house. It is so sad. We're around nearly like we're at part nine. Like this has just got to change. Um, Alison, Dahl, can we not take up the bar when someone could be using it? Thanks, Dahl. Tommy can have his bed. And then I'm hopefully... There's going to be promotions galore tomorrow, hopefully. So we're going to hopefully be getting Dora, Sam, and David promoted. We just really want to make sure they go to work in the best of the best moods, which they should be all right with. And Dora's up nice and early, getting an early start in. Um, Alison, Dahl, um, it's 2.36 a.m., um, like, I'm not really one to talk. It's literally 2 a.m. here right now while I'm recording. But, Alison, you've got school tomorrow. Go to bed. Thanks, doll. Okay. Serve some brekkie. Get some omelettes. Because I think we only have, like, one or two servings. Um, no. I want you to make breakfast. Thanks, doll. Sam, how are we doing? Okay, I think Sam could probably get up and start his day as well. Don't have to worry about Peter. He's literally fine. Um, yeah, you just literally used up mm. all of the oh. serving seats oh. for doing that. I hate how they do that. Like, I know it's cute, but I want to, like, not, half of these aren't even going to get eaten. It's like we've got to put them all away. It's just kind of annoying. It's just really annoying. Anyway, no homework that's been missed or anything. No. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Sam's going to have fun. Oh. So focused on that promotion. Maybe she's been forgetting to spend some time with Peter. Maybe Peter's been so focused on his, you know, multiple like media outlets. He hasn't really been paying much attention to Samantha. So yeah, alluding to something. What am I doing? We will see. Stay tuned for the next part, guys. Honestly, it's very exciting. Okay. Well, wow, he's struggling. I literally thought I just heard a baby crying. I literally have PTSD from this game. Oh, of course it's not real, guys. It's just a game. Um, okay, you guys are so lazy. Oh, you literally did you just clog the toilet, you absolute idiot? No, you're doing that. Love that for us. Anyway. Sam. Oh, she's in such a good mood. Dora's in such a good mood. Very exciting. Anything we can do while we're waiting just to kill some time. Check out the trash. Take a stove with a scrub. Oh, the shower is dirty. Don't have time for that. We are getting promoted. Okay, 
happy that you could actually be useful instead of playing games. You could so very easily unpack the toilet. Um, we'll get to see the kids in their cute little um prim no, not, not primary private school outfits because they are now private school students. Um, what's the commotion? Oh, it's we're waiting on poor little Dora. She literally, her and Morty like the cop like. <laughs> She's waddling, guys, okay? Honestly, she threw a hip out last night with Morty. Give her a break, guys. No need to honk, honestly. <laughs> okay, what are you doing? Okay, cute. Go play catch, but I don't actually want you to do that. Go do that on your own time. This is promotion time, babe. Get in that car pool. And go get some money. Let's go see that cute. Look how cute. So respectable, we love it. Okay, why is no one else coming to school? Okay, here we go. Does he have work soon? Yeah, he does. Okay, did you unclog the toilet? You actually did. Thank you for doing that. You are not completely useless, Peter. Thank you. Amazing. Okay, Alison is completely useless. Sorry, she did not make the bed. Don't interrupt what I was saying. Oh, he has a flash cut. Perks of being a medium magnate. Yeah, you can wait. I'm the, I'm the CEO of the company. Guys, literally. All right, let's suss out how we're doing. Okay, oh, it didn't go up. Oh, hers went up more. Oh, Sam's the one who went up the most. I really want them to get promoted today, guys. We also forgot to plan his outfit. I'm gonna make that his first thing he does when he comes home. He can do it in his own, actually, and make his bed slob. Okay. After talking with the teacher about reading extra books on the reading list, Charlie is confronted by a classmate who tells her that extra reading is the stupidest idea ever. Um, I don't remember asking for his opinion. Um, that a classmate extols, I don't know what that word means, um, the benefits of television and the idiocy of books. He is going to go so far in his life. We love that for him. Should Charlotte attempt to reason with the buffoon or agree to move on? Some people cannot be reasoned with. That is something I have learnt in my fast food journey. There is some people, like, you just, you cannot get through to them. So I think you should just agree. Yeah, good. She gained some literature enthusiasm. I did not even read that. It was just not worth my time. We have more important things to do. Booyah. This weekend's just, oh my God, I was about to say weekend. This week has been amazing. Let's make next week more of the same. Greeting Charlotte. Oh, she's just got into some random hobby thing. What she get into? Film and literature. Cool. Don't care. Um, oh, we can get Tommy. Oh, I deleted the newspaper. I was going to say, we could get Tommy a part-time job. That'd be really, really fun. Um, where is Shala? Did you forget about Sh Why did Shala not come home? What? Why were there two school buses? You both go to the same private school. What? You guys saw that. That was so, so weird. Oh, that's not... I told Peter. Not Peter. Oh, my God. That... Oh, my God. I'm, like, literally getting the rooms muddled up. This is so quirky of me. Anyway, she didn't make her bed. Not Peter. David. Oh, my God. That name's going up so much. Okay, he can focus on his um, cooking school because the other girls... Uh, so much higher than him. Morty. Oh my god, he wants to re-break his he wants to re-throw out his hip. But Dora, she's at work doll. The work day feels long and no one seems to be working well. A co-worker suggests a mid-work five-minute dance party and several people begin to dance with no music playing. Should Peter join the spontaneous idea or remain seated in case of a miserable failure? Join in! Yeah, good on you. Get involved, Peter. You're the CEO of the company, honestly. Oh Shelby. He's taken. Morty is taken, doll. Does she have work today yet? Yeah, no, she doesn't. She can go fill in the... Oh, her thumb's like... She won't. She will stop filling in the hole because she's bored. Please get promoted. Oh, my gosh. Yay, we did get a promotion. Oh, yay. Okay, so Dora did it. That's okay. It's not like she's going to die or anything. Like, I really just want... Poor Dora. Okay, so I'm sorry. But poor Dora has been in her golden years looking after toddlers, raising toddlers, teaching them skills, changing diapers, cleaning the bloody house up, cooking food for everyone, and working her butt off to support the family. 
She, I want her to be able to retire and enjoy her life, but I'm not letting her retire until she fulfills her lifetime want of becoming the education minister. So let her get promoted. You are being cruel, Sims. Okay, anyway. David has been promoted to Battle of the Bands judge. Musicians come from near and far to show off their stuff. And it's you who decide who goes on the record, on, sorry, goes on to record greatness and who goes back to the garage. What a good week it's been. I hope I can keep this up. I hope you can keep this up too, David. I want promotions, 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 honestly. Oh, he's got work tomorrow. Good opportunity for him to get promoted again, I think. All right. Yep, you're doing amazing, Dora. You positive attitude. I love to see it. Okay. I just wish the kids would place their homework in the right spot. David looking suave in his new outfit. Um... Just put your homework on the desk like it would actually. What one's this? Who is that? Alison. Okay, gotta put it on the right desk. Courtney on the left one. Okay, make yourselves useful, girls. So you mood up so you can do your homework. Just wait for Sam to get home and then we'll end the part. Please get promoted, Samantha. Please. Please. <gasps> She's lost a friend. Nearly It's okay, it didn't go down because we're best friends forever, which is really good. <gasps> Samantha has been promoted to senior college professor. Oh my God, college senior professor. I'm not dyslexic, sorry guys. Your position gives you the kind of credentials you need to tell people that you're smart. That is so sad. Oh my God, we don't need to prove anything 21. Oh, stay on top of your research, but don't forget about your classes. <gasps> she brought home so much money. That's like $6,000. Okay, I'm sorry. I said I wasn't going to do anything this part. Well, I'm going to end it like 30 minutes, but that's going out the window. We need a second bathroom. We need it. Like, it's just, it's literally just a necessity at this point. What way does the door open? I want it to open that way. Okay. Bye-bye, disgusting toilet. All right. Um, oh, I will probably just have to repaint these walls. Cool, 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 cool. Okay. Oh, wrong button. Okay. I really, really am obsessed with this toilet. It's just so cute. Um, what's the best layout? Probably not. Oh, I was gonna say probably not toilet. Like right in front of there. Yeah. What am I thinking? I want to get another shower. Oh, hitting all the wrong buttons today. Shower, toilet, and I think just a cute little basin. I'm just get the same one. Like this is just a a go-to bathroom layout. Honestly, I want to see what mirror goes with this. That is a really weird mirror. Anyway, popping that mirror there. Four thousand dollars remaining. Um, we could easily get some windows. Okay, where were we at with windows? We've literally been trying to get windows in this house since part one. It's so sad. Um. I like them kind of bunched together like they are here. So two windows there. Oh my God, we need to buy garage doors as well. Forgot about that. I don't like those actually. Let's get the dark one. Cute. Okay, that costed so much money. Anyway, there's like no windows into the kitchen. That's actually really sad. Oh, I kind of really regret layout um because you want like natural light going into your kitchen hey i also really don't know why i've really done this quite badly hey let's just rejig this a little bit i feel like that makes a bit more sense don't you reckon like that way it's kind of lined up here and you've got like that space you could so fit a cute plant in the corner. Oh my god, we are literally like I'm literally like a a dream home decorator, honestly. Stunning. Um, we didn't buy from memory. We didn't buy a dishwasher. Yeah, we didn't. So we'll probably get that in. So once again, neglecting my windows. Oh good. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother with any more windows. We bought one for there. All good. Okay, I think I'm going to leave this part here now, guys. Um, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you're enjoying. Um, and I'll see you guys back for part 10. Um, have a lovely day, guys. See you next time.